Welcome back to another exciting episode. Today we're going to do another unboxing. The Ryobi 14 inch cordless chainsaw. <laughs> Gaslight power. <laughs> so come along with me and see what we can see. Now this is going to be an unboxing and a first use video. All righty. So let's go ahead and take a look at this on the back of the box. 14 inch chainsaw, gas like power. It comes with a 40 volt lithium battery platform. Uh, it's actually a four amp hour battery and it does come with the charger supposedly. I hope at least it's, it was advertised as that. Um, it does automatically adjust the power for optimal performance. So we're gonna see exactly what that means when we go to use it. All right, so let's cut this thing open. Ooh. All right, so as we open this up, you can see in the box, it is packaged very well. Now this, by the way, I did uh, buy, so it is a purchase. It's, it's not something where you will be gave me. And I also had it delivered to the house. So you can have delivery on this. Oh, there is the battery. <laughs> So we do have a battery that comes with it, 40 volt battery. And oh, there's like a little mini charger. So there's a little charger right here. Nice. Comes with instructions and stuff. And then, See if we can get this out of the box. Okay, put this aside. Ah, and there it is. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. All right. So what we are gonna do here today, we're going to take off the safety shield Little snip, done. Make sure we have our blade that's supposed to be attached to it. Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh okay, we got the blade, put that back on. Now it did not come with bar oil. And I don't think they would have Oh my goodness. Ah. That's on it really tight. But you can see from the side right here that there is no bar oil that's in there. So what I did is I did purchase some bar oil um, as well separately. I did not bring that into the house. And of course, as you might be able to see, I do have cardboard right here uh, on the table. So just in case this thing's a little greased up, it does get all over the, the table, which my wife would kill me. All right. So, there we go. Let's open up this box, which again is supposed to be the 40 volt battery. It also comes with a operation manual and the uh, warranty. And there that is. Go ahead and open this thing up. 
Ooh, now let's see. It's almost a dead battery, which is fine. We'll go ahead and plug this thing in. This is the, the charger itself, as you can see. And the way this is supposed to go in is quite simple, quite just a little slide. Come on, yeah. and that's it. Yeah, it doesn't really snap in like the big one, big chargers do, this little portable charger. But I kind of like this, because you can put this pretty much anywhere. I mean, it does have a little bit of a click in there, but not that much. Just enough to make sure it doesn't fall off completely, I guess. And you just kind of push on this bottom piece here, pull it out, and that's it. So, not really much for the unboxing. I'm gonna set this aside, go over the literature, just real quick. Just to make sure we got everything we're supposed to get. And so you know what to expect if you get one. Oh, and by the way, I'll put a link down below uh, to get this if you, if you want. It says register your product uh, to protect your product at register.ryobitools.com. Now, if you already uh, registered uh, different items, different Ryobi tools on ryobi.com, you can go to ryobi.com put in your username or password and actually do this as well. However, if you go to register this, you can also register your outdoor tool for a chance to win $10,000. Wow. Cool. Okay, I'll, I'll do that. That enticed me enough. Okay. We have a product list of all the products that will go with a uh, 40 volt system that you can get more of those uh, it talks about the operations manual for the for the charger right there so that is the manual for the charger and the creme de la creme we have the manual for the beast itself, for the chainsaw. Let's see, it goes over the general warning signs, uh, safety rules, um, chainsaw warnings, lots of chainsaw warnings. How to cut and all that good stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and go through this a little bit more. We're gonna go test it out and we'll go from there. So come on with me outside and we'll see what this thing can go through. Okay, now that I changed my shirt and my hat to more appropriate uh, dirty gear, let's go ahead and put some oil into the chainsaw and see how this thing cuts down a small tree. Take the cap off. Uh, you can't lose the cap, that's a good thing for me. Get some bar and chain oil. Doesn't really matter what brand you get. Go ahead and fill up the reservoir. we go ahead put the battery in 
See I charge it up to full power. Put that right on in there. Oops. <laughs> It'll help me put it in the correct way. There you go. All right. It only go in one way. So. Take the safety shield off. I know I have it upside down, but I <laughs> just want to make sure I show you. Ugh, there you go. And then you're supposed to run it a little bit. Make sure that oil get, make sure that oil gets on there. There we go. And by the way, the way you run this thing, there's a safety switch here. You got to pull back, and you pull back on the lever. And that's how you do. Okay, this little tree is in my old garden area. Now it's not big enough to notch out or anything, so I'm just gonna cut it straight down. Not bad. Yeah, that wasn't bad, not bad at all. I didn't have any exhaust blowing into my face <laughs> as I was cutting down the tree. It actually wasn't all that noisy either, which is why I didn't wear ear, ear protection, although I think I'm going to uh, from now on, because it was a bit of a whiny sound. I didn't think it was gonna be quite that whiny but it kind of makes sense. I mean, a blade's turning, so yeah, wear ear protection as well. Now, just as one final test, a tree the exact same size as the tree behind me, I did cut down, as you see right here with the pile like, way behind there. I think I got it in the shot. So yes, a lot of time and effort in this. And as you can see here, I only took up two of the bars. Now granted, it's a brand new battery, but not bad, not bad at all. Okay, that about does it for outside. Let's go inside and finish this up. Okay, thank you for coming along with me for the unboxing of the 14 inch Ryobi 40 volt chainsaw. I'd really appreciate it if you could like this video, write a comment, and please subscribe. Oh, and hit that bell while you're at it. And as always, have a great day.